10 Unique Facts About What the Bible Says About Relationships Before Marriage List 10 Unique Facts About What the Bible Says About Relationships Before Marriage List Verse and Description Marriage is a Covenant Malachi 2.14 says The Lord is witness between you and the wife of your youth, against whom you have dealt treacherously, though she is your companion and your wife by covenant. This verse emphasizes that marriage is a covenant, not just a legal contract. Love is the foundation of marriage. 1 Corinthians 13 4-7 says love is patient, love is kind, it does not envy, it does not boast, it is not proud, it does not dishonor others, it is not self-seeking, it is not easily angered, it keeps no record of wrongs. Love does not delight in evil but rejoices with the truth. It always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Respect is key. Ephesians 5:33 says let each one of you in particular so love his own wife as himself, and let the wife see that she respects her husband. This verse emphasizes that respect is essential in a marriage. Be faithful. Hebrews 13:4 says marriage should be honored by all, and the marriage bed kept pure, for God will judge the adulterer and all the sexually immoral. This verse is a reminder to remain faithful to one's spouse. Honesty is important. Proverbs 30:18-19 says there are three things that are too amazing for me that I do not understand, the way of an eagle in the sky, the way of a snake on a rock, the way of a ship on the high seas, and the way of a man with a young woman. This passage is a reminder of the importance of honesty in relationships. Submit to each other. Ephesians 5:21 says submit to one another out of reverence for Christ. This verse is a reminder that couples should submit to each other out of love and respect for God. Do not be unequally yoked. 2 Corinthians 6:14 says do not be unequally yoked with unbelievers. For what partnership has righteousness with lawlessness? Or what fellowship has light with darkness? This verse is a reminder that Christians should not be in relationships with those who do not share their faith. Be patient. 1 Corinthians 7 8-9 says to the unmarried and the widows I say that it is good for them to remain single, as I am. But if they cannot exercise self-control, they should marry. For it is better to marry than to burn with passion. This passage is a reminder to be patient and wait for the right person. Do not be sexually immoral. 1 Thessalonians 4 3-5 says for this is the will of God, your sanctification that you abstain from sexual immorality, that each one of you know how to control his own body in holiness and honor, not in the passion of lust like the Gentiles who do not know God. This passage is a reminder to remain sexually pure before marriage. Pray for your future spouse. Psalm 37 4 says delight yourself in the Lord, and he will give you the desires of your heart. This verse is a reminder to pray for your future spouse and to seek God's will in your relationships. Father, Grandfather, Minister, Missionary, Deacon, Elder, Author, Welcome to our family. View all posts.